Kathy. Hi. Welcome to Man Talks. Hello. Welcome. Welcome to my hot seat. Goldilocks locks are being locked off today. It was fun because I had told Paulina that I was going to do it and cut my hair today, and she didn't realize I was going to come in with <laughs> missing hair. So, Paulina, how long have you known Kathy? Um, probably about three years almost. And she's always had her long hair. Always had long blonde hair. And this is it. We're cutting it off. We're chopping it off. Now, where's your? Well, I started early. You see, I started early. So, tell us what you did. Yesterday morning, I decided, New Year's Day, I decided, as part of my resolution, I was sticking to my desire to cut my hair. So I thought, I know me, I'm going to go in there and go, you know what, we'll do it next time, I'm in a hurry, I don't, you know, no. So I took a scissors out of the drawer and I just stood there for a while like, you can't go back. <laughs> and finally I just went, how did like, you do that? It feels so good. And then I went, <laughs> All the way around, it was like, oh my gosh! But it was—it felt so great, and it's like, now I got to do it. But I've wanted to do it. It's just you know, we we do we have things we want to do, and then we procrastinate. We find reasons why we can't do them. And it's like, no, I want to do it. Why do I keep putting it off? Okay. So I, I ensure that I would not be able to put it off, <laughs> unless I got extensions put back in. <laughs> well, and here I am, Anna from Man Talks. I am sitting here watching her get her hair colored, and then. Chopped off. How short are we going to oh, go? Wait, the secret's out. I colored my hair. Uh -huh. um, well, we've been discussing that. I don't. I want it short enough that I could still pull a little bit of it back if I needed to. To just hair bugs me, but I want it short. I want it. I promised my kids I wouldn't do princess dye. I always had the princess dye cut, so I said I wouldn't do princess dye. I'm trying to think of princess dye's cut. Oh, just the very short in the back, and she had a little bit. Did she have a little? Like feathered around her face. Yeah, like, kind of like, um, Kathy, that's a beautiful cut. You should do whatever you like. No, I, I, I look back at the picture and it is, it, it's nice for the time. I just don't think it's, it's in yeah. style. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I don't know if there is even a style. Anymore. That's okay. We're embracing getting older. We can yeah. use any style. That's right. That's even right. the Beetle Bob. How about well, the Beetle Bob? <laughs> no bobs. I do not want a bob. I don't want. I don't like straight bangs and then psh, hair. Right. And I'm going to probably change the part kind of a little bit more to the side. Um, it's funny though, women, when you go and look at pictures and I'll you know, Google like um, women over 50, short hair with bangs, um, you still get a lot of younger women with the short haircut. And so I would just like block out their face to see, could this go on anybody? And some of them can, and some are like, no, it really does look. But I look back at my pictures, like my headshots, and I think that even the long, long hair just hanging there, it was just, it was uninteresting. Just long hair that just kind of hung there on me, and I did that all the time. I always went back to that. So I needed to change. Did you spend, would you say you spend most of your life with long hair? Yes. Yeah. A couple times I would go short. And then it grew, my hair grows ridiculously fast. Yes, like, it if does. you know me, my hair grows like. In a month, you'll have her long exactly. hair again. So I don't stress about it, so. It's hair, it's hair. Okay, let me stop.